What is your message to HDP and all workers around the world? My message to, uh, well, sorry, first, I, the first time I visited Turkey was in 2002, a long time ago, and I met some wonderful people in Diabaka and uh, Batman and, and, and Juan uh, in the Far East. Um, really, really impressive. At that time, I was really impressed by their courage and, and their uh, solidarity with each other. Um, and over the years, the more, more and more I went back, the more impressed I've been with the movement that has been built over there through trade unions, through community organisations and through the political uh, parties. And when I attended the Congress uh, the, of the HDP in February, you know, you saw uh, the realisation of all that work over many years of many, many people um, who have achieved this. So first of all, I'd like to say I, pl I applaud all of those thousands of people uh, who have built a movement um, around the HDP, which includes all sorts of different forces within society. So I would, um, on every May Day, every year, wish to send uh, greetings to all those people, the party leaders, the party activists, the party supporters. The HDP is an inspiration to us all, but I'd, I'd like to say, particularly at this time, with the COVID, uh, uh, this is one of the times in May Day where we, we want to come together and express our solidarity in meetings and rallies and demonstrations. And of course, at the moment, uh, we, can't, we can't do that. Um, so I would say to all of, all of my comrades and friends in, in Turkey, the trade unionists that I uh, have met on many occasions and continue to, to offer support to, to keep strong and uh, keep your organisation strong because the workers need trade unions, the workers need uh, their organisations to fight for justice and the people need a political expression and the HDP provide that political expression. So my May Day message to all of those people is to say, stay safe first of all, stay strong, work together, build maximum unity in the workplaces and maximum unity in the community and internationally we can work together to achieve the better, the freer, the more democratic and the peaceful society that we all wish for. That's our hope for May Day and that's my message to them today. Stefan Smelly, a um, member of the International Committee and the Trade Union Legion Officer for Peace in Kurdistan. Thank you for, very much for joining us today, supporting our program, and thanks for sharing your comments and ideas with us. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you.